Hello there, this is Jay from JCAD. I make AutoCAD tutorials for students and professionals in the fields of architecture and interior design. If you are new to our channel, hit the subscribe button to get our weekly tutorials on AutoCAD and other design software. And in this video, I will be talking about how to make the line weight appear in AutoCAD or how to make the thickness of the line appear. So AutoCAD by default, when you are setting up the line weight, it doesn't show it. So I'm gonna create a new line here and let's say from here to here, and then I'm gonna select it and change the line weight either here from the properties uh, section under the home ribbon or from the full blown properties menu on the right side that I have here. Um, you, can, you can open properties menu by clicking control one and that will open it, okay? So I'm gonna change the line weight here um, let's say to let's see let's just do any number actually and you can see it doesn't appear and even if we make a thicker one it still doesn't appear so here we go nothing is visible so there's few places where you can change the setting to see the line weight one of them is actually from the line weight to drop down menu from here and you can see there is line weight settings and I'm gonna click on it and then here we can say choose display line weight and then we can hit OK and here we go now we see the different line weights in in AutoCAD now also here let's see from the line weight yes from here you can't access the line weight settings from the properties menu there's one more additional location where you can see that is basically from the drafting settings is by clicking on this icon uh, show or hide line weight if you have this hidden on your end which most likely it will be by in AutoCAD uh, if you just start the software by default it's hidden you need to go to this menu right here on the customization on the bottom right corner I'm gonna click on it and then from here you will need to select let's see where it is line weight I clicked on it the icon disappeared if I click again it will appear and then you can click here and that will turn on the line weight visibility all right uh, there's also additional uh, there's something there's more information I want to talk about regarding the line weight AutoCAD you might be thinking here that on the properties menu you see thickness that maybe if you change the thickness of a line here that will make it show up and I will show you that actually that's not the case because I'm gonna select this line and change the thickness here to let's say one inch and I'm gonna click enter and you don't see it because actually the thickness is specifically for 3d representation of elements and that is not supported by AutoCAD LT you can do uh, 3d 3d work here essentially and this is uh, this is how uh, Autodesk explains it how the line uh, what's the what's the thickness essentially so let's say you have an object like this you drew it in 2d this is if you change the elevation of the object and then let's say we assign a thickness for the circle right here and it will appear like this but again this is irrelevant for AutoCAD LT so that remains uh, in AutoCAD the full version so um, you wouldn't you, you don't need to use this it will not help you you'll just need to use the line weight okay uh, one more technique to change the line weight of a line is by using the polyline command and here is polyline and I'm gonna start it and I'm just gonna click from here to here and click enter I'm gonna select polyline and this is why I had the properties menu open originally is to show you here that on uh, the polyline if you go under to the geometry properties and then look here you will see that we have the option here to change the width so you've seen now thickness you've seen line weight and now this is a different term the width so in here let's look at the global width for this uh, polyline and I'm gonna change it here to one inch for example and here you go we get a one inch thick polyline this is the width of the polyline itself and another one is mm -hmm the start segment width and end segment width so what you can do actually is that have the thickness set up at a certain value in the beginning and then it ends at a different width let me show you this how I'm gonna change just the end segment width to two inches and click enter and here you go the polyline starts with one inch 
and it ends with two inch okay and global width now it's uh, uh, it's blocked out because now we have these two set up two different values for the beginning and the end I don't know a handy use for this but I guess definitely it's worth mentioning for you in this video and that was it and how to make the line weights appear in AutoCAD